a porch pirate was brutally apprehended. I don't know, man. This sh is whack. Has been beaten to death with a rusty hammer. I just think the people of Garbery are really scared. Who is responsible? <clears throat> Go ahead and introduce yourself. Hi, my name is Eric Rothenberg. I am 23 years old, and I'm a superhero. The Crimson Hammer uh, really means something to the people of Garbury. I adopted the persona of the Crimson Hammer about four years ago. It all started with ordering an HDMI cable online. The delivery said that it showed up and it shipped and is at my door. And when I went to my door, it wasn't there. So I was, I was bewildered. So I went back and I reviewed the security footage because I have, I have the, um, the Ding Dong camera. It showed that somebody followed the delivery driver to my house and they went up to my package, which was a very expensive HDMI cable, might I add, and they walked away. That was the moment I knew that I needed to do something about this injustice. I grew up in Massachusetts. And yeah, it was a pretty like upper middle class upbringing. Hello? Am I connected? Am I in? I'm Eric's mother. Well, I guess you could say I'm the Crimson Hammer's mother. <laughs> Eric, um, he's got such a strong moral compass. Friends? Oh, oh no, uh, he had a few. Um, he had, um, um, oh, he had, uh, James. Do not even get me started on his romantic life. I'm married to the Crimson Hammer. I don't really exist outside of the Crimson Hammer. Oh, how did I get the hammer? Uh, well, I work at Handy's Hardware and uh, I was uh, trying to purchase an item. So I was waiting in line and someone cut in front of me and I was so mad that I grabbed the closest thing, which happened to be a hammer. And I waited for the guy to go into the parking lot and I followed him and then I bust his kneecaps. That's justice. I start every morning, I, I wake up at the same time, I get up at 8.30, I'll like sleep with the hammer just in case any flipper push come in. They're like, Crimson, where are, you know, where are you? And I, I go whack, right in, right in the kneecaps. Yeah, then uh, after I have the my my nutritious breakfast, I work out and I work out nonstop. I'm, you know, I'm doing, I'm focusing on all of my muscle groups. Um, I'm, I'm practicing with the hammer, you know, Using my hammer, it's, it's like dancing. I gotta get in sync with the hammer before I do anything. Once I do that, I will go out for a patrol, which you'll um, you'll accompany me today. Get to see a real day in the life of a superhero. So the first step for stopping crime is finding a bad guy. <laughs> yeah. Second step, it's it's simple really. It's uh, serving justice. Step three is uh, you, you gotta hit him with a one-liner. Um, you know, hit him with something like, Nice to meet you! <laughs> right in the kneecaps. You know, sometimes I, I get carried away. But I think that carrying out justice, it's a learning process. <laughs> Look, I acknowledge that people who get hit by a hammer probably deserve to get hit by a hammer. Uh, it's not what it looks like? Well, I do have a roommate. Um, his name's Jerry. You know, sometimes we don't always see eye to eye, but we respect each other's spaces. And I think that we make a pretty good team. Uh, I'm Jerry, and I'm Eric's roommate. I'm gonna be straight up. Living with Eric sucks. I met Eric on a Craigslist ad. I'm pretty sure what he's doing is felony assault. So... As long as he keeps his stuff in his room and he's not in the common space, keeps the sink clean, it's like whatever, I guess. He's like my sidekick. <laughs> you know, being a superhero isn't really what it's made out to be. You have to sacrifice 
uh, a lot. I mean, do I think this is really gonna take off and, and be a career? As long as it's not Mighty Caps, you can do whatever the hell he wants. I think that it's all gonna be worth it in the end. I think people are gonna look back on this 20 years from now and be like, wow, that Crimson Hammer guy is probably really hot. He's, he's so smart. That, that's beside the point. I think that the people eventually are gonna say, Crimson, we're sorry. And, and you're right. And we're wrong. And I'm gonna say, yeah. You were. Because I'm a superhero. And that's what heroes do.